Hi everybody. I am back down here at the Thermal I'm sorry, back down here at the Feather River near the Thermalito Bridge right there. It's a beautiful sunset, so I've kind of had to dodge into the rocks here to, so the light's not blinding me or you guys. Um, just thought I'd report on some of the stuff that I've been doing lately uh, and about the town, of course. Uh, so I just got done doing some drone video of the um, dredging operation. The, not the actual dredging operation because that area is still off of the fly zone list, but just before it, right near the diversion dam, that's where they're taking the tailings from all that area and bringing it. I'm calling it tailings because, you know, I'm an expert because I've watched American, uh, I'm sorry, Ala uh, gold mining Alaska. But anyway, so that area up there, uh, I just got some great video of the tug moving around the, um, the different, what are they called? Uh, well, the tug moving around the tailings up there and just the overall work over there. So I'll post that up tonight. I'm going to get that up tonight, no matter if I sleep or not, because sleeps for sleeps for mere mortals. <laughs> um, and uh, I also just got some video of the brand new open roundabout. I think the first video that's been done of that area, it just opened a few hours ago. It was open in the morning for a short time, closed throughout the day, now it's completely open. So that's a great thing. I really like the roundabout, I think it's great. Uh, took a long time to build. Uh, as I said at some point on the uh, forums, uh, that it, I think they built the pyramids quicker, but it's beautiful, so it, it's worth it. Uh, anyway, about the river since that's what we're standing right next to first as always right next to the water because that's where I like to be uh, I would uh, first the dam is letting out uh, what are they at they're at uh, 9,000 cubic feet per second uh, out of the high watt power station which has I believe three turbines running don't quote me on that but um, they definitely got another one turned on today uh, they also uh, they also continue to work on getting rid of the of the debris down there. Uh, they're at about 600,000 cubic feet of debris they've moved, and you can see that all over the place. They have some of that they've put up near the emergency spillway. Uh, they've also put some of it um, near the diversion dam just up the river. So uh, you can see that stuff is going everywhere. I, I don't know what they're going to do with it. I'm not a construction worker, but it has definitely been spread out all over the place. Uh, uh, Someone on Facebook, I believe it was Pee Wee, he put uh, up that they're filling in one of the ponds over near the diversion pool. I haven't been able to get into that. Uh, it was a little bright when I finished flying the drone, so I'll probably do that tomorrow. Uh, I'm also going to finish doing my survey of the Feather River tomorrow because as we can see, let me just show you real quick. Let me come out here in the light. And if you look down that river, that's way too bright. <laughs> so there is just no way that I can fly the drone and get good video of that with the sun like that. It's beautiful, of course, and it is a beautiful day down here. If you can get down to the river, come down here, clean up a little trash, just enjoy it, since it is actually the lifeblood of Oroville, one way or the other, right? Uh, it, sure, we've had a couple floods, but we none of us would even be here if it wasn't for the dam in this river. Um, as far as as far as where they're at on the lake level, I believe it's risen a bit. I think it's about 860 feet. That's rounded, 859 and some change. Um, that they expected, but now that they have the plant running, they can control that a little better. Uh, I don't know what the future holds on that, but I will report it each time I can. And I think that's what I got for today, besides just the general view to show you guys. So right back there is the beautiful. Thermalito Bridge uh, in it, all of its glory in the sunset. I don't know I can pan around too much because there's a lot of light out here, but this is the what a lot of people swim at, or used to swim at, or maybe still do, uh, down here under the bridge. All that area over there. So it's actually really beautiful down here. That's all I have for today. I have a State of Jefferson meeting to take some video of and report on. So I will hopefully see some of you guys there. If not, if you haven't made it to the meeting, I'll put up that video too. Uh, most of the videos that are, that are not live will be going up via, faith, uh, via YouTube. So I'll post links up on my page and I'll share them around the various groups on the Oroville groups. And if you guys could repost those, share, like, subscribe, that would be awesome too. So thank you very much. Have a great day and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.